uh, George here. Um, okay, I'm um, I'm gonna just give, uh, give an update uh, slowly uh, as the year 2020 draws to a close. It's been such an interesting year, right? Uh, lots of events uh, geopolitically and with the pandemic. The first things, um, there are lots of things going on uh, behind the scenes, uh, behind the facade of what you see on the television and uh, social media of the mainstream mainstream variety if you are fortunate and you have been basically researching into um, you know what the people would say conspiracy theories you maybe have come up with what's really going on and I'm not going to be mentioning that here because um, the general philosophy of this thing is it's better for you find out, to find out for yourself through questioning things rather than to be told you see you can't be told you have to be shown and you have to basically develop an, uh, an inquiring mind but I, I think I, I think it's fair only to say that what's happening in the mainstream media and in uh, in mainstream social media is not really happening. It's like a, a facade. A, 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 it's almost like a a, a play or with a with a with a with a, with a script. Um, and the purpose of this play play or or, or um, scenario or pantomime, as some people might say is to uh, deprogram the masses because we have been uh, basically programmed by mass media over well, a long period of time, decades, maybe even hundreds of years, who knows, uh, uh, to actually accept as true without question certain in bits of information that's given to us by uh, what we consider authoritative sources without really questioning it in our own minds. So I would just encourage you to to pray uh, to God, um, and you know, and, and of course accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, right? And He will be given the Holy Spirit, and the Holy Spirit will lead you to truth. And um, if you ask uh, God to lead you to the truth, God will do that. It's a prayer that is answered because God is truth. He's just asking to be led to God. So ask God to lead you to the truth. A prayer that's always answered. And what you will find is that over time, uh, you are going to be um, uh, given information uh, 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 by God through coincidences and things that will lead you there. Um, so it's a very positive thing, uh, you know. Uh, it, it, so let's say people wondering, you know, who's um, the, the good news is that <clears throat> the good guys win because God wins. <laughs> it's really uh, at, the, at the core of what's going on in the world now besides uh, behind all the noise it's really a battle between God and Satan or God wins Satan is always trying to um, um, force the battle um, in a time of his <clears throat> own choosing but um, but God was always seeing ahead and so you know in the end of the day uh, it's God's plan that gets executed so all of this is, uh, you know, God is in control. So, wondering about what's going on in the U.S. elections, what's going on with the pandemic, um, it's nothing to, to worry about, right? Just pray that be close to God during this time. Uh, pray to God to reveal to you uh, information that will tell you what's really going on, right? And uh, you'll find that it's a, a lot of good things are happening. Of course, there are some risks, right? So be discerning, right, about what's going on. And so what's uh, this process I'm describing to you is a process of deprogramming. And uh, it's the opposite of programming. We're programming, you accept blindly of uh, information from authoritative sources. We're deprogramming as you question uh, information that you receive and you uh, try to find out what's the underlying truth. All right, so I hope, I hope you enjoy that journey and uh, <clears throat> trust God you know and if anything just be close to him and you'll be fine all right so don't worry about uh, all of the uh, negative detailing news as a matter of fact I would probably say that it's probably prudent not to watch too much television anyway um, because uh, if I, I find that every time I watch television I get uh, a very negative feeling so it's probably intentional. There are probably things that are shown there, not only in the news, but also maybe in uh, entertainment that is meant to um, engender negative thoughts in you. 
uh, you know, aside from the usual nonsense about all the sin that goes on in in uh, in, the, in the media nowadays. Okay, uh, better to read, uh, pray, and uh, you know, listen uh, to people whom you um, trust, uh, and you use your discernment. Maybe ask God. I mean, for example, me. Uh, should you listen to me? Well, I know you. You, you, you pray to God. And ask God whether you should listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, then, 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 based on that, you know, if you don't, you said you don't listen to this guy, then don't listen to me. Okay. So, anyway, this. All right. Hang in there. Twenty twenty is almost over. Twenty twenty one. Um, I think it's gonna be a very interesting year. Good stuff. Good stuff. So, bye for now. And if I don't see you again, uh, so I don't really post every day. Happy year. <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs>